Hey guys, so in this video, I have a Copeland Digital Scroll Compressor. Copeland Digital Scroll Compressor. And as you can see, I got my gauges hooked up. And what I'm trying to do here, I'm a refrigerant tank right here. I'm trying to add some refrigerant to this system. But trying to do this with the digital scroll active it's a nightmare okay I could be a nightmare look at what's going on with your pressures uh, super heat and sub cooling as the digital scroll loads and unloads you can hear as the compressor loads and unloads and you can see how your pressures and temperatures is moving all over the place so if you're trying to have refrigerant while this is happening it, it's going to be a nightmare so if you don't know what to do then you'll really go nuts so i'm going to show you in this video all right it's simple so all digital scroll compressor is going to have a solenoid that's going to activate or to activate and deactivate to load and unload the compressor right so there's going to be a, always this solenoid where it's going to be it's going to be visible or it's not going to be visible you have to remove a cover like this one pop that cover off and you'll see the solenoid and in this case solenoid right here so all i'm going to do is simply pull the wire one of the two wires from the solenoid and that's it the compressor will be running full throttle balls out no loading no unloading it'll be a full load fully loaded and it will remain that way until you're charged or until you finish with your charge you know and or until you put the wire back install the wire back into the solenoid so in the case if you want to have refrigerant that's how you'll do it if you want to really check your charge and see your system is running Super heat and sub cooling. There you go. So now everything's going to level out, and I'm going to see, really see what I have. It's no longer clicking on and off, you're no longer loading and loading. So I can see really exactly what I have. See what's going on right here? Alright, so that's it for this video, guys. Just want to show you real quick how you do that. If you like it, if it helped you out, give it a big thumbs up.